possible. This is the Red Nun's convent! Everything was burnt. Can't leave, not with this snowstorm. Lynn! Gloria and the others, they had all gone mad. Wasn't there another way to stop them? blind, then they drugged us and burned us alive. We will forever be in debt with you for giving us our freedom back. But now, go away. What does it all mean? This photo? Was Lin one of you? We don't want to hurt you. But this is our game now. It is no longer any of your business. Go away, Jennifer. Go fuck yourself! Where the fuck is Lynn? Where? What have you done to her? It was your last chance, and you wasted it! Fuck, I've been hurt. Looks like they've 
to us. They deserve to be punished. Where are you? Show yourself! You're not so different from the others after all. Then again, you are a Felton. I will go away. I will go away. But Lynn is coming with me. You are free to do so. We are free to do so. If you're not with us, you're against us. Odin, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have to be quick. I have to find that fucking bitch there upstairs. I know she's there. Maybe I can use my power. Darren! Help me! She's there. Maybe I can use my... <coughs> Stop it! It's me, Jen! 
to be quick. Find a way to stun her and disarm her. Lynn is being controlled by her. I have to find her and stop her at once. Sure, I don't get caught. I have to be quick. I have to find that fucking bitch there upstairs. I know she's there. Maybe I can use my power. bitch upstairs and maybe I can use my power
Hey, are you okay? No, uh, I, I don't know. I... What's wrong with you now? She's only been here a couple of days and she's made a mess of everything. Lynn, where's Lynn? Who the hell are you talking about? Go! Get a rag! Jesus Christ! It's in the utility closet, Jen. You do remember where the key is, don't you? I don't know what stuff you girls smoke today, but there's no Lynn and there never has been. Is there a problem, young lady? Lynn? I don't know any Lynn. I... I don't understand. Why do I feel like I've been through all this before? It feels like deja vu. I can almost remember something. Maybe I'm going crazy. I've been here before, but everything was different. I can't shake this feeling. How did I get back to the hotel? Don't you understand, girl? Gloria, one. You're now a part of them, too. You've been integrated. You'll only remember what she wants you to remember. Gloria? Ashman's sister? This is where Elisa... Um, I remember that something happened here. There used to be a key somewhere around here. How did I know that? And why can't I remember anything else? They will never remember Lynn exists. Gloria won't let them. She's now her medium. There's no time left. Find Lynn. Use her push. Stop the hypnosis. It's the only solution. Who? My stomach is turning, but I'm so fucking hungry. However, I don't think I'd be able to digest a breadcrumb right now. You know... They used to call me Wyvern, once upon a time. What? A violin? Yes, now I remember. Lindsay, Lynn! It wasn't a dream after all. I remember! I have to go back! I have to go back to the dumb waiter! You can stop it. I only slowed her down. That's all I could do after letting my consciousness be fragmented in my body, become a host for the parasites. You're the only one who can awaken my... Awaken them all. I did. Gloria is so nice th to me. Why shouldn't she be? You're such a nice girl. Professor Wyman. Yes, my dear? That stuff that you gave me is the same that you made me use on the others. Will it make me turn b b blind like that? Why, why? God, no. What are you talking about? Will I forget everything? That's enough. You know that I would never use that shit on you. Oh, my dear. It's for their own good. You don't want them to suffer any longer, do you? I don't want to hurt them. And <laughs> you don't want them to hurt Ashman and I, right? Yes. <laughs> you know very well that it wasn't me that made such drastic decisions. Ashman is desperate. Lynn, their eyes burn. They would feel the wrath of hell with just a simple ray of sunlight. It is agonizing. You care about Gloria, don't you? She, she is like a sister. 
have to pour a little bit, light a match, and it will all be over forever. So tell me, will you do it? <laughs> I'll do it. Great. Let's start. <laughs> in a limbo. What could be used as a push? Think, Jen. Think! The song! My tape recorder. I could hook it up to the loudspeaker. go back to the hotel, to the cinema room. how it managed to move around the hotel unnoticed. I can't believe I'm still dragging around this lice-infested suitcase. I've had it since I was at the Flemington Institute. I have to reach the cinema room, in the old wing.
Why? Andrea! And what do we have here? Shouldn't you be cleaning room 212? Of course. And I am. It's just that... Uh, what? That... Uh, do you, by any chance, have a key for the cinema room? Ashman asked me to clean it up a bit. That's the least you could do, after the mess you made. You're absolutely right. Anyway, I'll be very quick, and then I'll, I'll come back to finish off room 212. <laughs> I can't help you. After what you did, Mr. Ashman insisted that no one else was to have access to the cinema room but himself. He has the only key. And I believe he's taking a nap in his room right now. I'll be quick. Let me speak with him. Young lady, don't make me say it again. Go to room 212 and do your job! to go into Ashman's room. I am sure that the cinema room key is there. While they're wandering around the house, I am here, working my ass off. It would be best if I just told him I don't work with crybabies. Okay, now I can have a look around the place. It's all their fault. Okay, I have to find the film before saying goodbye. The it was here. Gotcha. Gets any work before done saying here goodbye. It's me. No, 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 no! no. I beg you! I'll take this, my dear. <gasps> You cannot stop her! And it certainly won't be stuff like this that is going to stop her. And it's all your fault. You helped Gloria with it, breaking Wyman's loose. You asked me to do that! You were the ones who gave Gloria this power! Don't you understand? This doesn't only concern Lynn or me. This concerns everyone! It's useless! Your sister is controlling us like puppets! As did Wyman! Waking up Lynn from the limbo. This is the only way we can get rid of her! Gloria will only grow. She will continue to grow until she's gotten her revenge. You too will be part of her revenge. That same revenge which is consuming every cell in your body. My mother. She never loved you. Richard Felton, my father, is the only one she Felton. ever loved. That thing? A laughing stock. I am your father! No! Richard is and always has been! Regardless of his gender! Who cares? He brought me up! He was a great father! You're only a child! You are a laughing stock! A ridiculous child! Why don't you go play with your dolls? Keep your nose out of these things! Why don't you behave like other children? Play hide and seek! Or ring around the rosy. Yeah, let's do that for all time's sake. I beg you, I beg you. Ah, bitch. Okay, I have to return to the basement and play this film on the projector.
don't find me. <laughs> Move! Come on, come on! Play the damn thing! Play! <laughs> no! It's all their fault. The Feltons. Gloria, do you still believe it? Do you still believe this bullshit? You're lying. Bullshit! Tell her, Ash. Tell her! It was you who ordered to burn the place down! Tell her! Tell her why! Because despite the large doses of phenoxyl, she began getting her memories back. Isn't that right? Memories of you harassing her. You were only a little girl at the time. It was Lynn. She's the one who started the fire. She betrayed all of us. She you. didn't have a choice. You tricked her, drugged her, and forced her to do it. Gloria, you believe me? Right?
Ichi. Be strong.
I won't be satisfied until you all be dead. Lynn, I think I'll we start have to go. by killing your parents, Celeste. <sighs> <laughs> promise me that you'll put an end to this. I'm not going to promise anything. That you'll put an end to all of this. I want you to shoot me. Promise me. Promise me. Okay. Okay. I know that shortly after she returned to her parents, the Feltons, but things got out of hand. And you know, Gloria kept her promise. Her thirst for revenge was not quenched. But Jennifer managed to run away. I know that she's somewhere in Sweden now. She writes. She's a writer or something like that. Her publications are signed under a pen name. How many other people? What do you mean? Before you successfully found that Jennifer, and brought her to the Ashman Inn. How many before her? How many girls did you suspect to be the mother Acherontia? To then end up living under Porcelain's mercy? How many- They were simple mistakes! How many simple mistakes? Fourteen. Fourteen altogether. You will shoot me, won't you? Right? You deserve far worse. You deserve to suffer by living in agony, as I did. For the past 19 years. Whore! Fucking whore! You promised! Lynn, hmm? I can't. You heard what Gloria said earlier on. I have to go back. I have to return to my parents. But what about the contest? I'll be there, I promise. <laughs> Name for a violin. Read 
Rosemary. <laughs> red Rosemary. Uh, I prefer reed. <laughs> You give it back to me at the theater. Now you have no excuses for missing the performance! I'll see you there! <laughs> Promise me! We'll see each other at the top of the world! I didn't keep that promise. I returned to my parents the following day, the Feltons. Gloria followed me shortly after. She managed to subdue them. She got her revenge. I ran away again, leaving everything behind. I'm sure that if I hadn't, she would have killed me. And when? Who's just left there waiting for you? Madam, how did you come to know about this whole story? Did Rosemary, Lynn, try to contact you? No. She didn't. I think that as long as she knew that I was safe, and I had forgotten everything, nothing else mattered to her. But this doesn't explain everything else. It happened last year. Yes? Am I speaking with Celeste Felton? Who are you? I'm calling on behalf of Miss Lindsay. She is very weak now and has asked to see you. She left the following day. Ashman was right when he said Lynn was Wyman's inheritance, and the only thing that he left her was his Alzheimer. This is from her. old when, when, by now she would have been 64, 64 years old. She was one of the other Jennifers, one of the 14 gone missing, kidnapped, killed, 
before they successfully found the right one. Me. Lynn never managed to come to terms with it. For all these years, she held on to my memories, her own, and those of the other victims. I know she went back to the top of the world many times, hoping that maybe one day my memories might resurface. Theater on the stage at the piano. <laughs> <laughs> 